Welcome to the RJG YouTube channel. In this short video, we're going to show you how to set up a job in the RJG eDart system. So this will be the initial screen that you see once the eDart is connected. So now what we want to do is go in and actually set the job up. So one of the first things that we're going to see is that we're going to have to select a mold number or create a new. So in this case, we have no options up underneath. So we're going to hit create new and we're going to name our mold. So one thing to consider whenever you're naming a mold is make sure that it is unique and that everyone uses this same method. So the, the, the way that I've chosen to name this, I've got the mold number there and I've got the name of the product that it makes. So whenever you go back to start this job again, make sure you pull this. If you create another, another entry, that says mold one, and it's as simple as calling it a cup with a lowercase c instead of an uppercase c, the EDART is gonna recognize this as a totally different mold. So you'll have data stored in two different locations for the same mold. So try to keep it the same, make sure you're selecting the same mold all the way through. Once I get my naming down, I'm gonna hit accept here. And now it's going to highlight down below here on what type of material am I gonna use. So I'm gonna create new. So again, I'm just going to use, let's say we're using ABS here. Um, something that you may do um, that would keep this unique is you may run the same mold out of four or five different colors. So that you may have an ABS, an ABS green, an ABS blue. Um, you can create those as you go through here. Again, once you get your name uh, decided upon, just hit accept down at the bottom and enter the number of cavities. So in this case, we're just going to say it's a four cavity mold. Hit accept. Uh, when it comes to the plant, uh, we've got hanger here, but let's create a new plant. So we're just gonna hit create new. I'm gonna enter plant one. Um, it could be whatever you wanted, your address, um, your city, your location, your company name, anything you want in the, in the plant there. I'm gonna hit accept. Now I'm going to the sale. I'm gonna go create new. This could be something as simple as the machine number. Uh, what you actually call it inside of the facility. So I'm just going to call this press 10 and hit accept. Now I'm going to go to my machine. So what type of machine am I using here? Um, I'm just going to hit create new and I'm going to put Van Dorn. Okay. And we may want to put something in there that lets us know exactly what size it is. So maybe Van Dorn 110 ton. I'm just going to hit accept. Now I'm going to go up top here. And once I hit accept, this is telling me it's not connected to a server, which I'm fine with. I'm just going to hit connect. And this will bring us to the sensor location page. So now setting up the job is complete. We're at our sensor location page. We'll address this page in a new video. Um, feel free to ask any questions. Uh, leave any comments in the section below, and we thank you guys for watching.